Good morning, Soapbox Nation. Hey, I'm your host, Mad Morgan, and thank you for joining me for episode 99 of Soapbox Daily. Today, I don't know, today's going to be a lighter day. Just something quick and simple that I just observation and just something to put a little thought out there. But here we go. First of all, hey, how's your integrity been this week? How's your integrity today? Are you being the positive change? Are you being the positive change the world needs? Only you will know, and tomorrow's another day. So keep trying to be better and moving in the right direction. So today's topic, very simple, is do you ever take the time? This is our today's topic. Do you ever take the time? And what I mean by this is, do you ever take the time is, do you ever take the time in general? Do you take the time you need to reflect, take the time to sit back and appreciate something, take, take the time for yourself to collect your thoughts, to de-stress a little. This is important. You, you should always remember your self-maintenance, your self-maintenance to keep yourself in check. We're not always the best at actually keeping our physical health in check, eating the right things and taking the right medicines or medications or vitamins or stuff along those lines or doing stuff that we should. We kind of neglect those because of the everyday responsibilities of life and stresses. Other than physical health, also mental health is important. So you should always take the time to take the time for yourself. I know work can be stressful. I know life can be stressful. I know families can be stressful. I know there's so many stressful things that if they don't cause you stress, they cause you anxiety. But if you don't take the time to actually sit back, reflect, balance yourself out, it's just going to pile on and pile on and pile on and pile on. You're, you're no good if you come to a breakdown. You're no good to be able to do anything if you come to a breakdown. So you must maintain where you're currently at. So take the time. Take the time to appreciate stuff that you take for granted. Take the time to look at that sunset. Take the time to look at those flowers. Take the time to look at that picture. Take the time just for taking the time so your mind and your body can catch up to itself. And maybe reevaluate at that time. Hey, what am I missing? What do I need? What do I need to move forward? What do I need to make sense of it all? Make a list. Because if you don't make that time, you become overwhelmed, become overworked, overstressed. And every challenge that you have going against you is just going to keep piling on. So do yourself a favor. Take the time. I just, I guess the reason I bring this up is because I made a point of this because I used to just pile on, pile on, pile on, pile on over and over again in my own life. And every, I didn't stop. I, I figured I had bills to pay. I have to work. Oh, I have to work two jobs. Okay, I have to work 60 hours a week. Okay, I got to do all this stuff like that. Oh, I got to worry about family. I got to worry about friends. I got to worry about this. I got to worry about that. And I'll tell you, it just becomes overwhelming at times until I decided to sit back and go, okay, hang on. I'm doing everything right, but others are just expecting more and more and more and more and more. But if I keep going at the level that I'm at, I'm going to burn myself out. So I stepped back. I stepped back and I was like, okay, what do I need to do? Not what I feel I should do. Not what are the expectations being put on to me, but what do I need to do? And then figure out once you've taken care of what needs to be done, figure out how much more you can balance on top of that. But never lose sight of yourself. Consider yourself a machine. If you're not well oiled and you're not well maintained, you're not gonna function. But with a body, with a human body, it's not just physical, it's also mental. And in the mental, there's emotional as well. So if all those are in check, then you're good for yourself and you're good for everybody around you. You're good for the tasks that you need to do, the work you need to do, everything is good. But you gotta be good to yourself, first and foremost, because making lots of money and compromising health, that's stupid because you're, you're going to have not a long life, you're not have a long joyful existence if all you're doing is killing yourself for the almighty dollar. Pace yourself, longevity, <laughs> balance yourself out. I can go over the need for this, but keep in mind, it is important. Take time for yourself, in solitude even. It doesn't have to be for anybody else, it's just for you. Look out for yourself, take the time, enjoy, balance it out. All right, I'm gonna wrap this up for today, short and sweet. Thank you very much for listening. Appreciate you being here. For me, this is my way of giving back to the world. So this is why I do these podcasts. And this is helps what well, keeps me balanced. If it becomes too stressful, I step away from it, just like you should as well. If there's something that's putting too much expectations that you cannot balance in your life, step away from it. You have the right to do so. As long as it's not going to compromise keeping a roof over your head, just step back from it and go, whoa, I just need a pause. I need a break from this. 
I do it. You should too. It's sound advice, and I hope it serves you well. I'm your host, Matt Morgan. Thank you very much for tuning in. Keep your integrity in check, and I will see you next episode.